How are you doing everyone and welcome back to the Learn Our Drive Our Classroom. My name is Anthony and today we're going to be talking about the three most common mistakes I see people make with the steering wheel. The last few weeks I've been paying close attention to the mistakes people are making with the wheel. And once you master the wheel, you should have no problem with position. As I always say to my students, the straighter you can drive in the test, the better your result will be. So here's three quick tips to kind of keep you nice and straight on the road. Number one is when we're stopped at a red light, when it goes green, I always see people do a big steer to the right at a green light. All right, it sounds really simple, but everyone does it. All right, now don't mind this diagram, it's just a quick one today. Um, so what I always see, say for instance we're stuck, we're stopped at a red light and when it goes green, what I usually tell my students is mirror, mirror, handbrake down and go. That's all you have to do but what I see people do is mirror, mirror, handbrake, big stare to the right and then they try to move off the line. What happens there is it moves them out from the good position they were in and then straight away they have to fix it again. When it will be much easier to just hold the wheel straight, mirror, mirror, handbrake down, hold the wheel straight and continue on straight in good road position. All right, it sounds really easy, but look at what you do when the light goes green and if you do a big steer to the right, try to make your hands not do it basically, just try to hold it nice and straight. So the second most common mistake I see people make with the steering wheel is when we're taking the left, so taking the left steer off when turning left at a T-junction, right? So I'll explain what I mean there. Say for instance we're driving up to a T-junction and what, so we always do our mirror signal, position slow, look all right. At a T-junction what I tell people is as you're driving up when your front wheels get to where the curb bends, that's when we steer. And we position the car around here. That's perfect. Then what I normally see people do is, when they're looking right and left, they straighten their wheel, which knocks off the, si the signal. And then as they drive, they have to steer left again to try to keep themselves in. What happens there is it knocks off your signal, it takes you wide and then you have to come back in on yourself. The best way to do that is as you come up, when your front wheels get to where the car bends, we position the car around, but the trick is we hold the wheel in that position. You've done the hard work now, that's when you look right and left, and that's when you just keep the wheel where it is and we just continue around and if you're still coming wide, then it's one more little steer that will keep you in. That's the best way to do that. It's the best way to keep you in when you're turning left at a T-junction. And the third most common mistake I've seen with the steering wheel is sharp steers when we're trying to fix our position on the street. So usually when we're driving, I usually tell people, try to keep them in on the left. When they feel they're drifting out, people tend to do a sharp steer to the left and it brings them in really fast, but then they do a sharp steer to the right, which brings them back out. And we kind of have this system where we're going in and out, up and down the road. The trick with position on the straight, if it's a dead straight road and you feel like the car is, you keep drifting out to the center, Usually all you have to do is hold the, the slightest bit of left steer on and usually for whatever reason that just usually keeps you nice and straight in on the left. If you feel you're drifting in and out, try avoid doing the sharp stairs because it's it's too it's too, it brings you in and out too much. It's just slight little small stairs that will try to keep you in. And for the first few lessons, really concentrate on keeping yourself nice and straight in on the left when there's no park cars on the left, of course. All right. So look, at that was just the three most common mistakes I've seen with the wheel the last, 
the last few weeks. Um, as I always say, once you master the steering, you should have no problem with position, all right? So steering is very important. So look, I hope you enjoyed the video. It was just a quick Saturday evening video. Uh, if you like the content, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a lovely weekend.